Hello and welcome back to Pokemon Ash Grey. I'm on my way to the tech school now, so let's go over there. I should hopefully be getting a few new Pokemon this episode, which would be good. I think it's the Kanto starters, pretty much. I can't quite remember. Anyway, let's get through these battles and get there. We'll find out then, won't we? Ponyta. Ponyta. Right, let's avoid as many people as I can. I only ran straight into her though. I can't be bothered with the battling at the moment. I want to get to the million more than anything. All you school children with your rubbish little Pokemon. Another Spearow. Another Fairy, perhaps? No, it's another Spearow. Wow, really? I wonder there's armies of them everywhere. Whoa! Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm never gonna get past him. School Kid Chad. Sand shoes. I love the sand shoes. Oh, look how cute they are. Oh, it's dead. Anyway. Bye, Chad. Think about her daddy? I don't know. Oddish. Trust, trust the little blast type girls to have the Oddish. And a Pidgey. Could you get any girlier if you tried? A Clefairy? Yes, you could, apparently. Ooh, look who I have now. Oh, there's a pond there. Is there anything in here? <laughs> <It's> <laughs> uh, that's better. That's more like it. Oh, I f fell out again. Let's try this pond. Do I come across Pokemon like this in the pond? Doesn't look like it. Ooh, is that Giselle? talking a lot. I'm quite glad I didn't go into reading this bit. Yes, it is Giselle! Cubone's quite a nifty little Pokemon at this point, to be quite honest. Level 20 Cubone. She's quite strong, actually. I didn't expect her Pokemon to be quite as high level as that. Oh, she only had one. Never mind. There's some things you just can't learn in school, and that's a good lesson. Thanks, Giselle. Okay, off I go. Ooh, a little bit of grass. A little bit of grass. Right, so onwards and upwards if I figure out how to get out of here. Without using cut. I don't think it's going to happen, is it? Oh wait, can I get a fishing rod from that guy? I can't remember what he had in his house. Oh no, he's a badge guy! Okay. He's in Vermillion, the guy I want. Okay. I don't know why I always thought it was his house. Maybe I'm thinking of a house in Fuchsia. Someone had a pond out the back of their house. The grass, meow. Not allowed a meow, I've actually didn't have one. The hidden village. Alright, let's have a switch about, let's go. Oh, it's an oddish! 
Ooh, sheesh. <laughs> oh, bless it. Oh, the Bulbasaur out of nowhere! I'm not doing the Bulbasaur sounds, I'm sorry. It just ran away with the Oddish, come back! Please do not capture any Pokemon you find here. This is a sanctuary for Pokemon. Oh, you just let me wander in here, okay. Well guarded, well guarded. Take your full heal though. The water is too rough. But I want to swim, I didn't want to use a raft. What? I found loads of stuff down here. Wow. Well, escape ropes anyway. Right. I'm just gonna fall through for there. Fall through all of them, aren't I? Um let's have a little look around. Oh hello. Oh hello, she said oh hello back! Oh hello, my name's Melanie. I moved to this place so I could create a sanctuary for Pokemon that have been hurt or abandoned by their trainers. Oh bless. This place is more like a spa. Those holes. Oh, I'm sorry. I was the one who set those traps. I wanted to catch Pokemon trainers before they reached the village. I was already in the village. There are so many injured Pokemon that I have to protect them. That's why I put up this sign asking not to catch any Pokemon here. Please respect that. Hmm, this Pokemon is a Bulbasaur. It volunteered to guard the whole village. It protects all the injured Pokemon whenever enemies try to attack them. Bulbasaur is the bravest and most loyal Pokemon I know. Ash, don't you agree? The Bulbasaur would be an excellent addition to your team. Oh, thank you, it would. I think Bulbasaur should go with you. Yes, please! Bulbasaur stayed here to protect the weak Pokemon, but this village is too small. The bulb in its back can't grow. It needs to go out into the world. Now, now, what? <laughs> to the world now, and I know you'll take good care of it. Please do me this favour, take Bulbasaur with, your journey, with you on your journey. It will join you on one condition, one one condition. You have to battle it first. I, do I have to catch it or kill it? What? Let's hope I just have to catch it. Oh, he looks cute though, doesn't he? Look at the Bulbasaur! I'm gonna catch ya! I've got ya! I have a Bulbasaur! Yay! I'm happy about that. So that's one of the starters down. He's calm. His ability's overgrown. Overgrow. Rather. Let's see what he knows. Oh, he's got an Everstone. Oh, he does actually come with an Everstone. Good, good. So he n he will never evolve. Which is good because Ash's ones don't evolve. So that's good. I'm glad that was put in. Whoever made this game, well done. out the other side. Where am I? I'm lost. Oh, it's just a stump in the middle of the ground. Charmander on a rock! It's a Charmander! It's just sitting there. Hello. It's a Charmander, but it refused to battle. Maybe it has a trainer. No, I want it. It's a random place to have a Pokemon Center, isn't it? It's just in the middle of nowhere. Right, come Bulbasaur, you're up front. Over here is Damien, hello. Are you a trainer? I am. I had a Charmander, but it was so weak, it couldn't even beat the weakest opponent. So I left it on a rock. So it stopped following me. Oh, poor Charmander. It's so... It's so stupid. 
on it. I lied and said I'll be back for it. It's so stupid that it's probably still waiting there for me. Oh, poor Charmander! Let's go back. Let's go talk to him again. It's raining and the Charmander's outside on a rock! Oh, he's talking to me now. Okay. Oh, come with me, Charmander. I'll look after you. Yes, take the Charmander. Yeah, that was easy. No, I don't want to give it a nickname. Oh, it's hasty. It's got a lucky egg. And its ability is blaze. No scratch, growl, and ember. Ah, oh, poor little Charmander. I saved it from the rain. Look at me go. And the boy's gone. He's just left the Charmander. He's completely gone. These mean people in the world. They came back for Charmander. No, you didn't. No. You're not having Charmander. It's a good thing I abandoned it too. That toughened it up. Besides, what's wrong with dumping off weak Pokemon? I wasn't going to come back for it, but now that I've seen what it can do, I'm real glad I ran into you. The best thing is, I didn't have to raise it myself. Huh? I didn't really raise it, did I? I took it to a centre. You're not having Charmander. I don't think so. Oh, it's dead. <laughs> good start, good start. Fairly sure we should have Squirtle soon as well. Oh, Butterfree, you won't be with me long. Makes me sad. And Charmander, you won't always obey me. Also makes me sad. Alright, drowsy down. Bulbasaur got another level, well done. Oh, he's a cute Bulbasaur though, isn't he? Look how cute he looks in this game. And he's going to stay like that forever. Right, so yeah, you're not having back the Charmander. Go away. Man just got full health and he's healthy and kicking now. Whoa! Squirrels his sunglasses on everywhere! <laughs> this to be the gang leader. Hello, Squirrel. He's staring intensely into your eyes if it wants a battle. Hold it right there! Officer Jenny. Are you alright? Have you been hurt here? That Pokemon gang calls itself the Squirtle Squad. They're all Squirtles who were deserted by their Pokemon trainers. They don't have a trainer, so they just run wild and play tricks on the whole town. It's really kind of sad because if they had somebody to care about them, they wouldn't have turned out to be as bad as they are. Please keep an eye out and be careful. If you see them again, let me know. Squirtle Squad. Causing havoc. Oh, it's a fishing guru! Maybe I can go fish again. Fish, just fish, just fish. Fish, 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 fish. Ah, uh, it's the magic up. <laughs> no, it's just the old one. I'm only gonna get magic up. Thought maybe it would, uh, you know, mix it up a little. But no. Oh, screw this. I don't have flash. I don't think. Ash has tools though, do I have anything I can light the path up with? Alright, let's get rid of the zoo back first. There we go. Uh no. I'm 
we'll just go for it in the dark then, shall we? Run into 600 Zubats on the way. Ooh, hello. Thank you, Jeff, for sneaking up on me in the dark. So nice of you. Oh. Let's switch. Eraticate! Well, that one's nice and easy. There we go. Oh, I can't see anything! It's Jeff again. Oh, I avoided a person there. I saw their legs. Yeah, it is really dark. Well done. Oh, don't have three Pidgeys. Yeah, you really do have three Pidgeys. Oh! Oh, yay! Way out! There's a Mart just sitting there. Buy some potions while I'm here. Why not? And some repels. I actually have money now. Oh. Don't tell me there's another exit. I really thought I was oh I thought I was home free then. <laughs> I want to get out. Well, maybe I'll swim. Oh. What? <laughs> Just jumped out of the water at me. Okay. Oh, Pikachu was hurt by a squirrel. I don't even know how. Where did they go? Oh, no. What are they doing to me? You shall not pass. I don't understand. Oh, oh, you're in the cave with my Pikachu. Thank you. It seems to be saying that it will allow you to give Pikachu the medicine it needs to heal. Only Super Potion will get the job done though. So I have to go to the... No, I didn't sell a Super Potion. Pretty sure it didn't, but oh well. Let's go and look. I suppose that's why the mart's there. What? I just need the super potion. Come on, give me the super potion. Yay, thank you. What a nice man. Where are you? There you are. There we go, Pikachu. It seems to want to join your journey. Oh, Squirtle's on my team. That was nice and easy. Thanks, Squirtle. Got a Charmander and a Squirtle. Just jump on my team. Brilliant. Is there a... <laughs> it's got a relaxed nature and it's his eye of his black glasses. Fantastic. You can take it him and his glasses everywhere. Well, hello Jenny. All of the Pokemon from the Squirtle Squad have been captured. Oh no. They all just turn themselves in. Oh it's a good thing. They're not being punished though. They just needed some more constructive needed something more constructive to do with their time. So I pointed them to the town firefighters. Yay! They seem to, to be really happy about that. I don't think the Squirtle Squad will be causing any more problems. Good to hear. Um, right. Ah! Oh! 
for millions down there, but there's... Ah, oh, Bill's house. It's too strong to swim. Hmm. Fish, fish, fish. Give me something other than a magic heart. There's got to be something in there. There should be a crabby. The current's not that strong. Oh! Oh, he's on the sand! Hello! I can get that! Ooh, crabby! It's been a good... A good episode for new team members. But crabby is probably going to stay in my box for a little while. Right, so actually after getting crabby I'm actually going to round off that episode there. Uh, so I managed to get Bulbasaur, Charmander and Squirtle and we got past the tech school, we've made it to Bill's house and I've also caught a Krabby. Yes, I was really happy to see the Squirtle squad. So I will be back next time and we will venture on into Vermilion. I'll see you then guys, bye!